five, four, three. We have ignition. And liftoff of the first United Launch Alliance Vulcan rocket, launching a new era in spaceflight to the moon and beyond. And it turns out part of Pittsburgh is on board. Overnight, the first U.S. moon landing mission in decades blasted off from the Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida. John Shumway is here to explain the major role that Pittsburgh is playing in this mission. And this is exciting, John. Yeah, it really is. And Pittsburgh is big time involved. The United Launch Alliance launched their Vulcan Centaur rocket from Florida to 18 this morning. It is the first lunar landing mission since the U.S was there in 1972 and on board Pittsburgh's astrobiotics first lunar lander called Peregrine. Now the lander contains a rover called Iris and Iris was developed by a team from Carnegie Mellon University. It will be the first university developed student led rover on the moon. Overnight capped off more than a decade of work and followed delays both in May and December. The lander will deliver a science instrument to the moon for international space agencies, NASA and customers like the university. It will take about 30 days for Peregrine to land. It is scheduled for February the 23rd. That's when the real work starts for the CMU team. We have 20 to 60 hours to take that golden opportunity that we've been given and turn it into something that's uh, hopefully helpful for any other future missions. Now they're going to be racing the clock because the battery on this thing is going to die. So the team hopes that their work will help with future research in space. And when it comes to calls to the end, that will help the rover remain on the surface of the moon for the rest of the time. They're even considering driving it as far away from the lander as possible. Hmm. That's, That's wild. They're going to be driving it. Yeah. I yeah. Was say, I just love how a piece of our area is there. It's yeah. incredible. Right. But yeah. if man goes back to the moon, will they have to pay a rental fee to use it? <laughs> <laughs> Let's cross that bridge. I know it's going to say there you this go. This is sponsored by Avis or what? <laughs>